Okay. Alright, so I'm going to show you guys how to remove the carburetor on your uh, blower. As you can see, we already removed the cover for the air filter, which is a sim. You should know how to remove them. Uh, they're real simple, just uh, four screws here. And that's what we're going to do is we're going to remove the screws in here. These are 3 8 So that slides off just like that, and you have to kind of tuck it back behind here. And now as you can see, well the cable actually came off, but what you just do is you actually just pull it out from here. And you just slide it out, and it's, it was on the middle one. Alright, so next what we're going to do is we're going to slide the fuel lines off. Uh, these I just put on yesterday, so this shouldn't be too difficult to get off. But uh, other than that, you can usually cut this here, and then they'll come off. Or just like cut a little slip, and you can usually still reuse the fuel lines a little bit, and then just take them off. Now there's gas in this car, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take it out away from the shop. And I don't encourage that you dump it all over the ground. State will come after and get you. Well, government will. Let me turn the radio off because uh, YouTube won't like that. Alright, I just also realized that I'm out of carb cleaner. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to use compressed air. Uh, you can use compressed air to get everything out. Usually if the carbs are real bad, you're going to need garb cleaner to break up some of that gum. But uh, got the carburetor off for now. So next video we'll be uh, disassembling and cleaning it.